Hey guys, what's going on? It's me, Will Patterson. Today, I'm going to be showing you 10 of the best logo animation reveals that I have seen on the internet. Okay, this first one is on the Graphic Design subreddit, and it's the McDonald's one. Really like it. It goes into IKEA, goes and does this weird jumpy thing with Burger King. That is so cool. It looks so smooth all the way around and then obviously there's a reddit one all of these will be linked down below in the description if you want to go check them out this next one is alex gorbanov and here's the order up logo i really love the way that it looks super clean it's got a qr code then straight in i like the fact that it tells me a lot about the company as it's playing there people say that logos don't tell you much about the company or they don't have to but when it comes to animating them you can get a bit more creative with this so i guess this is sort of like a company or a restaurant where you scan a qr code to place your order both of these are really nicely framed i like the fact that the motion is really slick all the way through and i love the logo type as well now if you want to learn more about how to get some presets that allow you to do this stick around to the end of the video this is the super design logo and i love the way that it's not a reveal per se it, it's more of just like a slick animation i like the logo design of it so thought i'd take a look and this is what we got really like the way that it could just be forever looping there it's like an impossible shape that goes all the way around but it shows you that simplicity really does work this is one of my personal favorite ones this is sniff for a new pet store logo love the way that it's super friendly the logo itself is clean it's got a dog in the negative space of the n very jumpy like a dog the dog is actually sniffing the bone which is the eye very clever this is an amazing use of motion in a logo design logos used to have to be like stationary and i guess they still do to for them to be a, a good logo design but nowadays with technology and the fact that we view most of these designs on devices that can play video it's great to have a motion in there if you have motion in it it becomes more memorable in some way using motion in logo design like this can allow viewers to see whether your company is more serious playful whether you want to be corporate whether you want to be casual it can tell you a lot about a company so it's a really good investment and it's something that i want to learn to do is to do more logo design animations or logo reveals now this next one is on the after effects subreddit and i like this one a lot because it is just the android logo it's just simply written in there i like the way that the android just pops up it's not the most creative and it won't be the most hard to design other people have said they would like the text to come out a bit faster but otherwise it's good and i agree i think it looks great with the text there but it could be just slightly faster it seems a bit too casual for me this one is close to my heart before i go into my most favorite one i just want to let you guys Guys know that there is actually a way to easily create logo reveals for your client projects or even just start to learn them. Invata Elements has over 55 million different assets from music to vector illustrations to fonts to graphic templates and also motion graphic templates for logo reveals they have a simple license so you don't have to worry whether you're going against the law or breaking some sort of copyright rule by using the work for your clients you're not because you have a simple license and the license still counts after the subscription has ended because we like you and because we broke a deal with Invato Elements you get 50% off the annual subscription of Invato Elements meaning that you get 55 million assets with that license for less than $20 a month you can see here that I'm actually using a template from Invato to add motion to a logo design this is really quick and easy I'm no motion design professional so having these templates there for me just to learn from and to also use for client projects for when I'm presenting them is super important and really convenient. Thanks again for sponsoring. Back to the video. This one is my favorite because it's all to do with aliens and it's an abduction. So imagine the company is called Abduction. This is what it is. It's like this flying chevron there or the TR-3B. I'm a nerd. And you can see that the dude is getting pulled up into the UFO. I really like that as well as the fact that the logo design itself is kind of like the silhouette of the night sky or space it opens up to create the part of the a the counter of the a and it works super nicely all the way through i like it really clean really minimal i get 
way too excited about things like this. This one you may have seen a lot, and this is the Google one. When they rebranded, they sort of changed their logo design to be really modern. And the way that they are using motion here explains a lot behind the logo decision. You can see the G full of different colors. You can see the icon there. It becomes a brand system. It's showing you that the colors are the same all the way through and you'll know what it's all about. You know, it's all about Google. And I really love the way that it's super quick very responsive it feels like you know it's just in the right place at the right time this is another ikea one that i really liked it's a bit slow and a bit clunky but it makes sense to ikea you see it's like paint drops it's just all being moved into place really like it i like the fact that it's all like messy kind of gloopy it'd be really interesting to know how many expressions they've used on these because i don't think you could achieve this with simple keyframing and if you can let me know in the comments below but that's actually blowing my mind I'm going to press the l button because i like it this next one's from labs it's hard to explain but it's kind of like glass morphing it's all morphing together really simplistic i love the labs logo by the way i really do like that but the thing that i like the most is the story behind the animation and the way that you You've made it move so it's kind of like you're focusing on one part really nice really minimal quick to the point when it feels like it's just in the right place you just know it you can't like sort of explain it but you just know when it's like everything is snapping together in the right timing here's another favorite of mine that i found this is hash dash i don't know what hash dash is um but what i really liked is the sort of the more playful approach here you've got like this dashing playhead then it turns into an arrow with the logo. I like that. It shows the component in the design. And I really like that. It shows this arrow, which is part of Hashdash, I guess. I've never seen the logo before, but I just thought that the animation was really clever and really nice. It could be, I don't know, this probably goes on a bit too long. I think going back and forth. That's just my opinion, though. And you know what you guys think about my opinion. So there you have it. Those are some of the best logo reveals and logo animations I could find on the internet. If you did enjoy the video and you want to see more for your own inspiration, then let me know down below in the comments. I'm interested to know whether you like this style of video or if you want one that's more tutorial based. If you haven't already, press the red subscribe button. You can always change your mind later and unsubscribe if you do not like the content that I bring out. Thank you for watching. If you liked the video, press the like button. If you didn't, press the dislike button twice and I'll catch you soon. Goodbye.